The Harbin Y-12 or Jun Su Shi-12 is a light monitor aircraft developed from its predecessor, the Harbin Y-11. The Y-12 was designed and developed by China's Harbin Aircraft Corporation, mainly used for both passenger and cargo transport. Its first flight was completed in July 1982 and is currently in service with countless operators around the world. The Y-12 has been designed to take off and land over short distances. The high wing arrangement provides for excellent lift and drag properties. The aircraft has been designed to execute passenger or cargo transportation, parachute jumping, geological exploration, aerial photography, and ocean surveillance operations. It can also perform a wide range of other missions, including medical rescue, touring, agricultural spraying, and forest applications. The Y-12 started as a development of the Harbin Y-11 airframe, current Y-11T, in 1980. The design featured numerous improvements, including a redesigned wing with a new low drag section, a larger fuselage and bonded rather than reverted construction. It also replaced the radial piston engines with turbo props. The aircraft is equipped with a single vertical stabilizer. The Chinese plane has a length of 14.86 meters, a wingspan of 17.23 meters, a height of 5.57 meters, an empty weight of 2.84 tons and a maximum takeoff weight of 5.3 tons. The Y-12 is powered by two Pratt and Winnie Canada PT6A27 turbo prop engines with 620 horsepower each. The aircraft is fitted with a Hatcher 3 blade propeller made of aluminum. The propeller, fitted with an anti-icing facility, can rotate at a constant speed of 2,200 revolutions per minute. The maximum and cruise speeds of the aircraft are 328 km per hour and 250 km per hour respectively. The range is 1,340 km and the service ceiling is 7,000 meters. My video about the Chinese Harbin Y-12 Ancier. Thank you for watching. If you find this video interesting, please give me your thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to support the channel. Goodbye and see you again in the next videos. Tạm biệt và hẹn gặp lại quý vị và các bạn trong các video tiếp theo.